controversial TV comment sparked speculation about King Charles's health, unraveling the truth behind the social media backlash. A recent comment made by journalist Carol Malone on a British TV show has ignited a wave of speculation and social media backlash regarding the health of King Charles III. The controversy arose when Malone suggested on the popular talk show, Jeremy Vine on Five Inches that the King may not actually have cancer, raising questions about the accuracy of the palace's official statements. Malone's remarks on the show lacked any substantiated evidence or clarification as to why the palace would have a motive to deceive the public about the king's health condition. Her statements left the audience puzzled, unable to discern whether she was spreading baseless rumours or relaying information from a reliable source. This incident sheds light on the delicate balance that the royal family must maintain when it comes to privacy surrounding health issues. In an era where every hint of mystery can fuel conspiracy theories, the royals face the challenge of addressing public curiosity while safeguarding their personal lives. The controversy surrounding King Charles's health also adds to the ongoing speculation surrounding Kate Middleton, who has been recovering from abdominal surgery. Social media platforms have become a breeding ground for rumours and conjecture, with users eagerly discussing and dissecting every detail of the royal family's medical situations. The comments made by Carol Malone during her appearance on Jeremy Vine on Five Inches regarding King Charles's health raised eyebrows and led to a heated exchange with the show's host. Malone suggested that the king did not have cancer but had undergone a prostate procedure instead. However, she failed to provide any substantial evidence or sources to support her claims, leaving viewers in a state of uncertainty. Host Jeremy Vine interjected, pointing out that the exact nature of the king's cancer had not been revealed to the public. Malone added that while she couldn't confirm whether it was cancer, the king had undergone a procedure for an enlarged prostate. Vine clarified that although the prostate test yielded normal results, the king had been diagnosed with cancer in another part of his body. As the controversy continues to unfold, the public is left grappling with questions surrounding the accuracy of the palace's statements and the true nature of King Charles's health condition. The lack of concrete information only fuels further speculation and theories showcasing the unpredictable nature of discussions surrounding the royal family's well-being. The saga surrounding Carol Malone's comments and the subsequent social media backlash highlights the challenges faced by the royals when it comes to maintaining privacy while addressing public curiosity. The incident serves as a reminder of the intense scrutiny that accompanies their every move and the impact it has on public perception. Eh?